You going crazy here? What you What's it say? Read it, man. What, read it, I ain't yeah. reading. The billionaire. Black I ain't reading it neither, I'm yo. I, I'm, I'm up with energy and vibes yeah, and I'm frequencies. Cool. I can't read. You read it. It's yours, nigga. You put it out. <laughs> Which one? Any of them. Read, read, read that one right there. Hey, Alex, put the arrow above the one you wanted to read. Oh, I didn't know you'd be. Yeah, that one right there. Yeah, that one right there. Yeah, I interviewed. F- yeah, that one. I that interviewed one. FBG Cash, and this was a clip from the interview. F- Who that? FBG Cash claims Lil Durk told him to take a photo at King Von's mural. Rest in peace, King Von. Rest in peace, Rest in FBG, peace FBG Cash. Cash. Yeah. Oh no, this is like a. This, also, is, this is not just an isolated incident. <laughs> that's what I'm <laughs> saying. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> that's what he talked about in the interview. That's what he talked about. That was it. I'm not funny to me. I mean, that's not a at all. It's an important. Not thing. It's an important thing you talk about. But it's, about. this is a, a, a microcosm of this business and what goes on and how some people look at look, like black artists, black lives. Like, come on, Adam, yeah, you got explain. a bigger responsibility than this, this. as a multi-millionaire truth from bomb. fucking hip hop. Truth bomb. bomb. <laughs> I know <laughs> all the, the guys. Listen, here. I know many, many truth guys bomb. from O Block. Right, I've been there. I know these guys. I interview a bunch of them. I fuck with them. I fuck with the GDs as well. None of them have told me that they think these titles are in any way out of line because to them it just seems like common sense. If you're going to interview these guys, of course you're going to talk about the shit that they actually talk about well, in their Now you music. sound like a label head. No, now I'm, I'm tight, Condor. I ain't going to hold you. Think about this. This interview came out. He had no complaints. How? None of the old blog guys had any complaints. You guys com- are so much more sensitive than the actual gang members. You know why? Because we're in our 40s. Right. Stop, 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 stop. Yeah, he's not wrapped up in this at all. Yeah, he's no, no, let me finish. I'm, I'm the same age. No, no, no. He's that saying too. he's saying we're more sensitive. Yeah. We're the young black people that are these kids' parents. Mm. These are our little brothers. These are our fucking nephews that are outside killing each other. And you white people are now interviewing them. Yo, 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 fucking... yo, yo, yo. What about when they let went to all... <laughs> What about when he Hold went up. on those music me... and dissed all his ops in the Can music so fin- that I could then I later love... ask him about it in interviews? Dog, I would love to finish. Finish, finish. He ain't making a money you are you sitting there interviewing these black kids that are fucking killing each other and y'all monetizing it that's not cool i don't give a fuck what they talking about in they songs y'all are turning a profit off of this black trauma of them killing each other yeah they the ones doing the killing because they young and they dumb and they don't fucking know no better we 45 and 46 years old and we know better because these are our nephews so you they look, not your nephews, so, and that's why you don't see the Kevin Samuel shit in the same light that we see it, because you're a white dude, and you don't understand what he is, except Kevin Samuels was causing a black... So drill finish. rappers aren't worth it, worthy of being interviewed? I'm not... Bro, you're not going to spin my words. I'm sharp. I mean, that's what I'm taking from what you're no, saying. No, that's not what I'm saying. I interviewed this I'm dude saying and I asked him about his music True. and his content. True. And what I'm telling you is he's 19, 20, 21 years old. He's going to give anything just to be on somebody's fucking camera and get some light shined on his project. I interview and rappers. What I'm saying is, he lost time. his he lost his life. I interview rappers on, all the time. These people who are, are losing their the lives, streets. and you keep telling me deep about the, the business of. And I interview of, them, and they don't. They don't, they know don't talk no about crazy shit. No, Adam. because they do know better. I'm oh, telling you, most one? street rappers, when you interview them, are not going to say shit about their ops, or they're not going to, they're, they're not going to, whatever. They're, Older they're, ones. They're smart about it, Older right? ones. Smarter he, ones. He, he was someone, saying ops. he was, no, he was someone, that's a normal word to me. He was someone who was more open about the people he was beefing with. Obviously, he's like Lil Durk's top op while he was living, right? Mm-hmm. And so, He's talking about his problems with Lil Durk Yo, because that. that's a that's a prominent theme in you his music and stuff. <laughs> stop. This ain't funny, You hang out with people who say Parks. Parks. It's not funny, okay. Parks. Stop, enemy. stop. His enemy is a word that has Bruh. been used for as long as time. Okay. He's talking about this stuff in his content, so I asked him about it during the interview because... That's what a lot of his content is True. about. Of course I want to know about the conflict that he has with one of the top rappers that he has beef with. True. How can I not ask these not guys saying, about the you are shit not they're saying, making music true, about? True, you're not saying one wrong thing. Right. You are not saying one wrong thing. What I'm saying is I find it somewhat disturbing that somebody that is outside of what these boys endure on a day-to-day basis interviewing them and monetizing it for your own personal gain when these kids are dying. 
This is them and their family's trauma that you guys are monetizing to turn a fucking profit. And you're calling it journalism. That's not fucking journalism. They're gaining man. from it as or well. Content. No, they're not. They co- yes, they no, do. they're losing. It's promoting his music I don't career. Ca- There's a reason why these dudes, in particular, you got Ruga and FBG Cash on the screen. They both fly to Los Angeles mm-hmm. to do an interview with me mm-hmm. because it's promoting their career and their business that they're building for themselves. The fact that FBG Cash got into this random ass situation where some his, his ex-girlfriend's new boyfriend shot him or whatever the fuck it was. What does that have to do with anything? That's about, just some bullshit I'm that happened after the fact. Oh, wait, 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 stop, 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 Lord. stop, Lord. stop, Lord. You just said stop, Lord. Lord. stop, Lord. stop, Lord. stop, Yo, you and your girlfriend, fuck? you said you and your, your... I was just saying that to make it clear fuck. that he didn't True. die over some gang shit. Like, True. it's not like he got killed by a rival gang member that he talked about in my interview. He got into some totally separate shit. Listen, you and your, you and your fiance were gonna, you said you guys got proposed to by somebody to do content. Right. You turned it down. Right. Why'd you turn it down? Because we ultimately decided that we could do a because fine you, job on our own. You Adam, found you a, have black friends growing up? No, time out. You found mm-hmm. another okay. way to monetize your content and cut them out. Right. You didn't need them. Right. They need you. Uh, no. You just they, said you it. You just said they, you just you said just they, said they needed you. They don't away. need me. They want to do content and, and reach out because to my audience. You and just stuff. said two sentences ago, my last question. FBG that they Cash both, had videos with millions of views before anybody interviewed them. I don't care. You just said that they profited and you profited. That's what yeah, you said. Yeah, it's a cool. mutual relationship. They don't know enough. It's like me taking a 17 year old girl or This 18. is a grown man. He just did like seven years in prison before he did this interview. How can you just Do treat you know him like a child and say oh, he doesn't know enough? Because mentally he's going on songs bragging about his fucking killings. I, that means he that don't seems know like enough. like an exaggeration. I don't know that he bragged about killing anyone. He'd probably be in prison if that was the case. But he's, he raps about street shit, right? Ice. He raps about street shit. What I'm saying is this. He keep a line. Every, yeah, guy. he does. Everybody that's grown ain't grown mentally. You agree with that or no? So you think I should I'm be doing like question. some sort of intelligence to... evaluation? Should no, I give them like a quiz no, where no. they have to I have to I, prove that their would... IQ is high enough? Before no, yeah, I, I think you them. should be doing that. No, but... he don't have to do that. <laughs> what I'm asking you is, do you agree with me, yes or no? That every grown person in age is not necessarily the sharpest knife in the drawer mentally. Do I agree that there's a range of intelligence? Yes, this of guy course. Won't yeah, sure. Okay, cool. Are there smart hey, people and are Joe there Biden. dumb people? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Hey, hey, yo, yo. hey but for him to have a problem with what I did up there, yo. he ain't answering a fucking y'all thing y'all up y'all here. Y'all there are smart y'all people and there are dumb people. Right, this cool. is easy. Yeah. All right, cool. So some, some people, would you agree also, are more easily manipulated than others? Sure, yeah. Cool. Okay. So in them doing this, they're coming on your platform because your platform is huge. Okay. Mm-hmm. Right? So do you agree that them coming on your platform, you said it already, that it has a benefit for them as well as you? Of course, yeah. So do you also think that you are monetizing this black beef trauma shit that these boys are going through? I mean, incidentally, yes. I am monetizing it because when we make content on YouTube, it's monetized by default. But that being said, this is content that the people clearly wanted to see. You see the view counts. These guys are popular. People mm-hmm. want to hear from them. There's tons of other platforms mm-hmm. interviewing them. So that's your rule. If people want to see it, I'm putting it out. It don't yeah. matter about yeah. because well, yeah. I mean, but you, saw the name of like this music. you realize I listen to drill music, right? Yeah. So these people are people I'm genuinely interested in meeting and having conversations with. It. And then I put it online. Hold it. up. Hold up. Hey, 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 hey. Wait, you know hey, what? Hey, hey. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Because I say it all the time here about how that's not a fan. That's not a fan. No, I actually listen to it. Like, actually, awesome. that is the music awesome. I like the most awesome. in the world. But same. But uh, your, go ahead, you finish your your behavior and your train of thought isn't aligned with the the uh, well being of these people. You just listening to songs. Let me give you. You don't really give a fuck. You don't really give a fuck about any of these people. Why? That's such an extreme leap for you to take. No, it's true. Wait, stop. Why? Listen. How? Wait, stop. Well, let me read some of your shit. Yeah, these are people I interviewed and then continue to have relationships with. Before he's reacts. To FBG Duck's mom. Like, you putting moms in this shit. She dissed him. What the fuck business you, is that of yours? She's a no. YouTuber. She's a whole personality out here. No, Everybody no. knows oh, her. This guy's going crazy. Even no, she is. I'm going to give you an example. This like, like you crazy. said you listen to Drew. They all know. That's that's yeah. the narrative about me that that's all I listen to. Not true, but that's the narrative. Okay. We sat down with an artist from the South. I'm not even going to say his name. Mm. Folks who are familiar with him know who he's beefing with. Mm-hmm. He's been beefing with. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm talking about? I do. Yeah. Yeah, Not once about. did we ask him anything about that. Nope. And yeah. could have had an entire amazing interview. Had an amazing had an amazing interview. You got a cookie? 
Cookies? It's chicken wings. Oh, it's a wings. wings. Did not ask him about that one time. At all. Right. At because all. we... We're not trying to you are shed light on that. that. We're not trying to promote that. You are that. promoting You that. are still an artist. You got There's more to you to, than that. Right. And, and we don't need to sit there and clickbait that. And that's the problem. We we delved into who this kid is as a person, what he grew up and what he endured in growing up. Y'all don't give a fuck. Y'all yeah. care about yeah. what the people are going to go to immediately. What can we put out here to get clicks? Fuck and, what happens because of this. Fuck if anything yes. comes back and, after this. And this shit is detrimental to these boys, evidently, because they fucking click? dying. And, and y'all could give two fucks about it because and y'all turning a penny from wait, it. Wait, 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 that's my only wait, wait, that's my out. Only Another weed is going to grow right where that one grew. That's my only When beat. he dies, it's going to be another fucking drill rapper to come take his place that we're going to interview and monetize I would like as well. To to that. That's and, ugly, and, bro. and here's my issue. I ain't seen one BMX biker nigga up there yet. <laughs> they are. They're he just done left the views. BMX niggas, came to hip hop, no did BMX, this shit. And you can find tons of BMX content that we make that incidentally Where's the BMX the nigga that died where you went to his mom and said, yo, this nigga died. He got shot in the fucking head. His mom said, fuck <laughs> these niggas over. Where's that from the niggas you fuck with, your little biker I'm niggas? I'm not aware of any sort of situation like that with BMX riders. I know. And guess what? I don't see none of these BMX shits with no six and 700,000 views neither. Yeah. So it's more money in the nigga trauma. Come no, on, I, dog. I mean, I interview rappers that I like and then I ask them about problems that they have with other rappers that they are open about on records. Because why? Because I'm interested and because I know that the fans are interested. Because Yo, you what's know with y'all's, that's what's, what's with y'all's, to, uh, the idea that that's what's, wrong when that's, I'm, what, I'm basically just describing YouTube. What you is interview your, people and you ask them about the shit that people are actually interested in. You guys trying to f- somehow find a way to make this this evil deed? I'm impressive. asking about it's your fascination with black I was, trauma. I'll give you that. No, this I is was, impressive storytelling. I was on You're your adding team this first. weird narrative nah. to what I'm doing. That I don't think is accurate at Adam, all. Adam, it's up there. It's not us. We reading your shit. But you're creating this narrative that I'm just doing this because that's like I don't know because I want to see these people die. No, or no, 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 Without, without the drama. The I do that all the time. And a lot of people just don't say shit. You'll ask them, so what was this line in this song? Was that about so-and-so? That, but and that's, they, not, that's and, not what and I that's said. That's not what he you, said. They don't no, give that's you not what I said. They're just no, not answering saying, your yeah, question. Can I do an interview in which I don't ask them anything interesting? Yes, of course. I, say, I think that's suboptimal. I'd, I, I'd rather do an see, interview see, that answers see, all see? the shit that the fans want to know. Why you can't find something interesting without that? Without death. I think that's very interesting. Why does it have to go to death? You're just assuming that everyone's dying. They are dying. These fucking kids. Most rappers who beef with each other do not die at the end of the beef it's just fucking words it's rap that's Why? where you see and that, that's the disconnect these niggas are really dying he knows. this so ain't just rap beef yeah, yeah. he knows this oh, is not so, rap beef so this certain, is street so beef with people that just so happen to- I got some smoke for you Ooh. rest in peace to the godfather Kevin Samuels rest in peace I don't like what you did after he died what it's disgusting what re-uploading the disgusting. parts of the interview disgusting what he do disc the nastiest performance I've ever seen what? Why do y'all do that? It's an insane position for somebody in media to hold. Please. What, what is your job as a content creator? Your job is to make content and get that content out to the people who want to see it. False. Somebody dies, there is a huge demand for that content. You re-upload it. People see it on their subscription feed. They click on it because this is a very talked about thing. People are Nasty. literally mourning I can't it. even listen to this. What, what is the part? That is disgusting. Give me a coherent argument against re-uploading content when that person is extremely newsworthy. Take it away, please. I gotta ask him. Yeah. Was the content in a negative no, connotation or no? No. What was your take on it? Uh, no, that, I won't that say, does I sound won't, nasty. I won't, I won't I say. I can see that. No, nah, that's why I was asking. Uh-huh. I wanted to clarify because I didn't. Nah, see he it. didn't. He didn't uh, slander his name. No, of course he not. just re-uploaded everything in the world that he had on Kevin Samuels in the moment that he died. We had never even uh, done clips from that interview, so I think we clipped a bunch. Until <laughs> you found clips. a good time to do it. Yeah. Well, that sounds oh, you, disgusting you to me. You had a Kevin Samuels. You had a Kevin Samuels interview. We had already done it. We didn't do clips at that time. We started a clips channel after that. We start. We went hard with the clips from that interview. After he passed, we had never done the clips before. How soon after he passed? 
uh, I don't know, Shit, next day. Hour. Yeah. <laughs> the next hour. One hour. Probably, yeah. It was nasty, Adam. What, what, like, is, like, like, what hold, is the nasty hold, part hold about it? yourself The nastiness is you are trying to capitalize off of somebody else's demise before his family even had an opportunity to How am I trying go. to capitalize on it? I want the people who are sad about his passing to have the content that they want to see. Then turn, off, to then turn off monetization. Hey, come if on, you turn up monetization, bro. you're gonna stop it from spreading on the platform. Stop Nobody's it, gonna see Adam, it. You, are, Adam. You know it's Adam, true. Stop you're a YouTuber. Adam, you know stop it. it yo. Every YouTuber out there knows I'm telling the truth. Is that why you did that? Well, stop. You. Because I thought that people. Yeah. The whole thing with the, making this content. If I do a joke, I'm gonna interview, market this off. Of is this. it nice that I made a bunch say, of money off? Say what you're on saying you? the right way, because I'm gonna upload this. Is it nice? Good. Is it nice that I made? Did I interview you for money? No. But I made, let's say, ten thousand dollars off of AdSense when I interviewed you. Did I interview you for money? No. I'm not is dead. Is the $10,000 very nice? But not, I'm not it's, dead. It's, it's different when... I'm not oh, dead. Oh, shit, he passed. Stop it, Adam. Let me, I'm let me, not let dead. Me, how does the death change that? A, a big... Like, because you because had he not passed, you wouldn't have uploaded that like that. Had there not been a giant swell of interest in this guy because he passed, then I wouldn't have uploaded it. Yeah, you, you just answered your question. I would have yeah. uploaded those clips either way. Yes, but the interest, why the you fact didn't? that the audience wants to see it, is the reason to upload it. No, Do the I audience was searching, the audience is searching his sure. name and it's like, you know what, if they're going to search his name, let me attach to that. That's exactly. They're not necessarily yes. going to look That's for it. Let me go see what clips are name. out there. The fact that they're He's searching trending. his name his is, name is trending and let me attach to it. to it. His name is trending, let me attach to it. Yes, let so me, let me get that, the fans That's saying something different. No, that's why it's illogical to do it. Why when someone dies do we act like people only make content to make money? It's not true. I want it to entertain the audience. You had the content already. Meaningful. You yeah. had the content that's already. Why. Right. Yeah. That's why. That's, that's why. the difference. He hadn't got around to uploading it, and then he passed. I'm like, fuck, we got to upload it. Of course. And that's what that, we're saying that's, to you. Yeah. That is what we're saying to I just, you. I, I don't think it's sinister. I don't see what's wrong with it. How do you not? I don't, I don't know. I don't get it. It hasn't been explained well. There's a difference between sinister and uh, something in between. There's something between sinister and innocent. <laughs> that's fair. That exists. That's true. There's being a capitalist, which yeah. is obviously a, a factor. Sure. Right. Yeah, we're going to make money off that it. That is okay. capitalism. But even if it's... Yo, like, yo what pull up the make? definition for sinister so I make sure I know what I'm saying. <laughs> Let, they get me with that a lot. Let's I say be we clear. got a million extra views from up, re-uploading all those kind of Samuels clips. That's sinister. Giving the impression that something harmful or evil is happening or will happen. That was sinister. You think no, it's evil no, to make people sinister. watch more YouTube content? I don't think it's sinister. I think, I think I it is. It's I'm, a, I'm only giving my opinion. It's I'm not asking y'all yes. y'all's opinion. It's capitalistic. My it's opinion is, like Ish said, before family members and loved ones get to put their loved one in the ground or have the important conversations with everybody in the family that loved this man, now every time we look at our phone, we have to see the likes of you, the likes of Vlad, the niggas that partake in that nasty side of the business, which is where it's only about metrics and monetization and your moral compass is totally eliminated from this. That's what makes this nasty. Are you ready? No, Are you it ready said, for the kill it said shot? to me, it's no, nasty. I'm not ready. You're ready no, for the kill no, shot. I'm not ready. ready. It said to me, damn, yo, when this important person dies, these are the figureheads. Some would call gatekeepers. Here, I have a very that important are, question. You won't let. You can't talk and listen. When Pop you, Smoke died, what did the radio stations do? I have no idea. They played the music. I, I no, don't. I don't make it right. I don't listen to Why the not? radio. He died. We uh, got to celebrate this motherfucker. We got to listen to the music that we all love that he made while he was alive. Playing his music is a celebration of his it's life. Totally I'm tell you why it's different. Watching a Kevin Samuels tell you why it's a celebration of who this man was. Different. Pop Smoke. Let me tell you why it's not. The music. I don't understand how y'all can't see that. I can answer you. I can answer you. Pop Smoke, his music was already mm-hmm. in rotation. Always played. Mm-hmm. Time is already in rotation. They didn't, yes. go, they didn't, they 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 didn't go dig it up out of a crate in a backyard somewhere and can, say because he chop died. The interview was already it. up. We just cut some clips from the interview. Y'all and we cut clips for two it. fucking weeks, That's Adam. The, it's the same as us playing his record on the radio. No, it's it not. Is not. That's what it is. Time out, hold up. Kevin Samuels' was already thing up. was his personality. The interview itself was up. We cut, like, I don't know, however many, maybe five, five more to than ten five. minute That's clips. More, it's more than five clips. Up. We haven't done that. We How many clips, clips did you That's clip? That's different. I, I have know absolutely no recollection. Well, it's your company. No. You, you like to fall back on that, that line. Three, four, five. How many? Not three or four. Find a way to get a definite number. It wasn't three, search Kevin and it Samuel's wasn't four. No jumper. Let's see what what I didn't know did. that it wasn't three, and to it wasn't defense. four. I don't need to search shit. It's it wasn't little, three or four. It's a little dis- distasteful to me, but it's not nasty. Or no, no, no. And to, to me, that's in disgusting. his okay. defense, I didn't know that he already aired his interview. 
Kevin I thought they had the interview in the tuck. No. And then when he died. Wait, out. Scroll back up to the oh, top so, so we can see I'm how far apart it is. I'm Kevin Samuels interview oh, one am. year ago, and then look at the clips are from like three months ago when he passed. One. We hadn't two, uploaded two, these clips yet. Three. We got three. Four. No, that's not five, that's not us. Just three. That four, that one's old. So three yeah, clips. A year ago. Three is. clips that all did a couple hundred thousand views at least each, because people four, in that four, moment four, wanted to talk. Four. About Kevin Samuels and wanted to, you know, cherish what he was to the community Scroll while up. he was out. Yeah, about four. We found three for the record. Three four. right there. You can four. see all of them right there. Kevin Samuels on interracial relationships. One. Yeah, read Stop the right there. Too. Read Stop the right too. there. Yeah, because that's important. Let's take one at a that, time. That is important. The headline is important. You don't see how at the time of a, of a man's death, you can take something controversial from them and post it. And have people feeling or looking at this in a, a light other than, hey, this man died. Let's a honor him and respect him. A very easy way to remedy him. this would have been like, rest in peace, Kevin Samuels. Here's tell his tell me that you are lacking the humanness to where you don't see what I'm saying. Kevin Samuels dedicated his life to spreading his message. You don't know. Wait, stop. He that's did. A, that's more bullshit. So you always challenge things that are so that's, evident. That's bu- his whole career was sitting on stream and making these videos and spreading his message to people. How could I possibly you, be faulted for spreading his message further after he passed, ar- knowing that this is the time oh when people God. are really going to want to consume this information? The arrogance of you. You have known of Kevin Samuels for how many years? Let's say you can't. Two? You can't surmise how shit he? about how, how Kevin Samuels. He? Who the fuck are you to know somebody for two years and think that you could say what their whole life was dedicated to? That's self-evident. But it's, it's like, no, it's not. His mission was to make content and spread his views to the world. Stop. You don't know that. Stop. You don't know that. Stop. That's, That's all you, you don't know. You, you are his lacking life was accountability. You saw him do it for two years. You saw him do it for two years. Right. How, well, how, if, how old was he? If he how old was he? If he had some other mission, he didn't express it to me during the interview. In the interview, he told me, this is what I'm doing. I think it's important. I think that I'm having an important impact on uh, specifically black people's relationships. That was what was important to him. Mm-hmm. So say that though. You yeah. said you said his life was based on something else. You Ma- didn't say that. Making content about the things that he believes in and interracial relationships were definitely something that he felt cool. strongly so, about. And I don't think there's anything wrong with further spreading his words after he passed. Not at all. I actually think I, it's more important. I didn't know that. The, the interview had already been released. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. That changes things from my opinion. For sure. However, now in seeing how you guys worded the clips, this mm. is clickbaity. This is absolutely a thousand percent clickbaity. When I hear clickbait, I hear good titling. Like titling a video Kevin, so people will actually watch it. True. Now, but you are playing on the fact that he was as the disdain for him might have been bigger than the positive popularity for him. Would you agree? I think the peop- that there's more people who loved him than people who hated him. I disagree. No way. Especially in the public. He got a lot of hate, but... A ton. No way. He got a big-ass the hate is what pro- the, the hate is what took him to the next level. His fan base was based on haters, though. I think yes. he got 80% love and 20% hate no as a result. No way. No Never. way. Never. No it's way. Not even Hitler, close. Dude. He not even close. No, not even close. Not but you know what? He could say that being coming from a white male. Maybe I was really kind of tuned out to the yes. the, he, the negativity. No, no, I, I'm, it's I'm, probably I'm, true. Yeah, he he's a, he's coming from a white male's perspective, mm-hmm. so he can potentially say that. But I know it, almost nobody who doesn't like the guy. You know, I, oh, everybody I know thought opposite. he was great. It is the exact it's the exact opposite in real life. It is the exact opposite. Like you and, say, you like and, even prior to you say his name, and it was like time out. No. And you did an interview with him a year ago, right? You guys you hang out with woke people. I don't. I don't. No, I don't no, know no. What they no, think. You, no. This, this is, is your job, though. <laughs> your job is to create content and keep your ear to the ground. Right. So I know when you put your con your 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 interview with him out a year ago, you mm-hmm. read the comments or no? Yeah, of course. He had some hate comments, a ton of them. Mm. Some, but a lot. Nah. nah, he had a, he had a come point. on. Most God, people, well, I would say most people. Come on, you guys know about I, Andrew Tate. Yeah. He just got banned off banned. Facebook and Instagram, but he he's like a more, a much more extreme Kevin Samuels. You know, he was saying a lot more offensive shit. And, what's his platform? What's and his, I still, you know, he's is. primarily I think streams on what is it YouTube? No, I mean, what's his um his yo a little bit oh, of a little bit of misogyny in there? You know, uh, misogynist. I mean, he's Kevin. He's a younger version. Uh, uh, I don't even want to talk about him. I think he's way more extreme than Kevin, so I don't want to put them in the same bucket. But I do feel like Andrew Tate gets a ton of hate, but it's still probably like 80%. Kevin Samuels on women preferring hustlers to work in men. That is disgusting labeling. 
Why? You don't that's see where you are said. disgusting it, but he, he doesn't died. Or he died. He I know died. what he said. He just died. I know what he said, but he just died. Right. So now who the fuck are you to come and highlight the controversial things that this man said? Because you are familiar with him for fucking two years. You think like, that's controversial? Think Women preferring 50 years hustlers old, to working men? Yes. And well, what is the no, controversial part about it? I thought it was a good title. Um, I don't, I don't know if... All right, so Joe Budden. So Joe Budden, Adam 22. So it was a lot of good points made. But ultimately, the way they was trying to paint Adam on some shit like that, that wasn't the shit. Or I got to say it more in depth. That wasn't the truth. The way they was trying to paint it, like how he was saying, like the narrative and shit. Like, what about world star hip hop? What about every media source? Like, now, if a media source, if all they do is discuss, you know, like, say if it was a channel or a, a, a company that all they talked about, say No Jumper, all they ever talked about was rappers getting killed or beef. And they interview a lot of other people. They talk about a whole lot of other shit. Um, they got La House phoning them with the fashion show and um, and, and Sharp with the, the pimping shit. And um, they do different shit. It's not like now... Rappers be dying and shit, and it's a hip, they're a hip hop based company. So it's like, they're going to like do reports and they're going to talk about that. Like, <laughs> that's an important thing. Like, it's not even like, he keep Adam saying newsworthy, but to me, the word I would use is that's important. You know what I'm saying? Like, why wouldn't we talk about somebody, a, a figure that has a fan base? You know, this is important to people. Like, they're not just their family, but their fans. Or this is something. And it might be important to the actual media source or the, whatever that is. Whether it's No Jump or whatever for that TV. Anything. Um. So, yeah, I don't think that he's... uh. Now, do Adam ask some motherfucking uh, racy questions like my nigga Octavian X told me one time? Shout out Octavian. You know, yeah, some little racy thing. Not race by color. I mean, like... Very, uh, uh, what's the word I'm using? I'm looking for, um, provocative. He, uh, yeah, provocative shit, you know, really, oh, the shit that people want to know, you know? So, and it's, you know, it's not like they force niggas to tell on these of them, but, um, I wouldn't say that, uh, Adam's, a, a, a just like, he's not out to do that. You see what I'm saying? Like, just based on the fact that that's not all he does. So, and then on top of that, if that was all he does, for real, for real, somebody else going to talk about it is 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 not private. It's not like he's going and getting secret information and then revealing it. The rappers are dissing each other on records. People are talking shit in public. Adam ain't the only one that see it. You see what I'm saying? The fans, everybody see it in public. They, they dissing videos, dissing Instagram posts and all this type of shit. So, that's really kind of the rapper's fault, you know what I mean? For even putting that content out, and I always say that, you know what I mean? If you don't want nobody to see it, or if you don't want to get indicted for it, don't put it out, period. You know what I mean? Um, but y'all let me know what y'all think. Y'all think Adam on some uh, some black, profiting on black people shit or not, man? I don't know. I, that's how I feel, bro. Like, comments, comment, because it's been gone. Yeah. Yeah, I'm smoking gas, feel like I cute. Oh. Feel like I cute. Bitch, I'm smoking gas, I feel like I cute. I feel like I cute, bitch. I'm smoking gas. I feel like I cute, yeah. I feel like I cute, bitch. I'm smoking gas. I feel like I cute, yeah. I feel like I cute. I'm sipping that red solo like I cute, yeah. Yeah. I got all these bitches 